All right, lads, so today we again once more back with the hard difficulty girl quest challenge where we only use one character. This time around, we're using the Christmas version of Noelle. She is max transcended and she has a very powerful soul bomb. She can do a lot of damage, but her strong attacks aren't really the best for this type of girl quest. Uh, so I'm not even too sure she'll be able to even do this, but I'm pretty confident the damage that she will get from her soul bomb will be the decided factor if we can beat it. The final boss, though, Dookie Mind, is a technique character, so we do have actually disadvantage but we'll see how it does go for those wondering the build that we are using on this noel is literally just this i don't want to actually let me quickly change that there we go. So now we have a Kamari, a Fortification Pill, and also a North Affiliation Sticker with the Halibow, giving 20% strong attack damage with an extra bit of extra full stamina damage. Chad giving us the recharge and once more 25% full stam. And then we have Aizen also giving strong attack damage and damage at full stamina, giving us a good hybrid of full stamina damage, recharge, and also strong attack damage, which will be the key to beating this quest, especially because she is max transcended with an additional 500 extra SP. For her bonus abilities, we give it a 25% full stamp and also weakened defense. And that should hopefully get us through and be able to beat this quest with only one character. So let's try it out. So I think our damage output is going to be solely reliant on actually being able to inflict a status one, which we actually did straight away. Okay, we'll take it. There we go, straight into Uru. This is going to be an annoying one because I, she can do quite a bit of damage. And for some reason, she has really good range. And we are doing a lot of damage. Hold on. SA2 there into the Gin. Unfortunately, wasn't able to actually get him into that strong attack too. We now once more have the spiritual pressure boost back up there. I'm going to use my SA1 here. Then Sobum. We are doing a lot of damage. Into Ichigo. SA3 into the two. Damn! <laughs> Should I be surprised? I don't know. Um... Maybe it's because we've been using a lot of 1 out of 5 characters and stuff like that to beat these challenges. But that was actually really quick. Far, way faster than, uh, than I thought it'd be. But I shouldn't be surprised. It's Noelle we're talking about. Noelle can do a lot of damage. Especially when she does get the SP boost, which we did get quite often there. And uh, yeah, that wasn't, a too, that wasn't a bad run. That was not a bad run. So what we're going to do next is try it again and see if we can go faster. Because mentally, I wasn't ready for that fast of a run. All right, so jumping into our second quest then, you know the Joe, we're going to use our SA2 there into the SA1, where we then use our SA3. Wow, hold on. <laughs> With that, I was so laggy. I right, hold on. This is going really well. My game's lagging. I I'll explain why in a minute. Hold on. Let me just see if I can finish this quest real quick. SA2 there. Got these spiritual pressure boots. Absolutely lovely. Oh, so close. We almost got a sub 20 second with only one character. That was absolutely mad. So a 22 second run there. One of the few times on the channel where we actually do a second run and get significantly faster than our first run. So you notice there's a lot of lag spikes. My uh, SSD is actually running very, very low and I'm running out of space. So the game is lagging every couple of seconds. But wow, 22 second run with Christmas Noel is actually really good. And we did get five orbs too. I feel like maybe depending on how the luck goes, we could maybe a sub 15 if possible. But regards, we'll take the run and yeah that was basically the one character guild quest challenge where we only use one character and so far again it's been quite good i've skipped out on two particular guild quests the immediate captain one and i think it was the immediate spider one that just happened and the reason was because again i didn't have time to record the captain one and then for the espada one it was just thousand year blood or rookie again it was basically the exact same type of video that we uploaded in the past where we used her to tackle the aranka weaker guild quest so in that case i didn't really want to upload it with that said though we have one more ticket so let's switch to our main team and see how that run does go. So this is the team that I used for this particular week. I have showcased it in the past and it still works just as well even like months later. So uh, this is Noelle. That's her build. We went with like a full stamina damage build. Again, full stamina and also weakened defense. Our second character is the other version of Noelle. She is only 4 out of 5 with level 10 SP and focus. So unfortunately, we could actually get a lot faster if we had, again, max transcended. But she is T20 with damage to weakened enemies and also full stamina. And again, just the basic build. Kamari, Fortification Pill, and also No Affiliation Sticker, all with 30% SP. And we are using as much full stamina slash strong attack damage as possible. Again, same build with the Nini. Nothing changed beside the fact that she, again, is also max transcended with full stamina damage and also weakened defense. So for the last time, let's jump into Guild Quest and see what run we can actually get. Okay. So, again, as you saw there, that it was a bit laggy. I, I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it. But we did get a pretty good score there. Again, probably could have went for like a sub one second. Again, if I reset enough, I could probably get higher. But I'm going to take it for now. We got a 1.8 second clear 
with this Noel, with this Burn the Witch type of team. And we did get two orbs there, so not too bad. But that's basically the general breakdown of team that I do use for this particular week. And also, again, once more, beating this guild quest of only using one character. With that said, let me know in the comments below what team you lads are using. And I'll see you lads next time. Peace.